Uh, I am Manuela Santa Caterina from the Odcarn, Italy. Hi, nice to meet you. Hello. Hi. So, Melanie, uh, how would you describe your character? Because um, at the beginning of the show, uh, we, we don't know much about her, and this is on purpose. So, what, what, how, how would you describe your character? Uh, I would say that my character is the tricky ghost. Uh, she's such a mystery. Uh, because um, after betrayal, she's gonna decide to quit with her family and to throw everything away and to leave everything behind her. And, um, and she's gonna have to rebuild herself um, in the foreign country. And she's gonna have to create a new identity and to, and to choose another family. So it's about all her journey and because she arrived in the foreign country, she, she, she might be a, a vulnerable target and, um, and she might, um, she might be, be mixed up with the wrong people and arrive in a circle of violence, violence of very, very, very tough. Um, and, um, and well, and, it, this character is, um, but there's always very something romantic about these characters because when you when you throws everything away, it's something so powerful, and uh, and it tells a lot of about, about somebody. You have to be very brave to to have the guts to to leave everything behind you. So and I like this um, this power uh, thing about uh, about the character. And um, what did you learn from her? Because uh, from what I from what I understand, uh, thanks to Antoine and, and what uh, he, he felt from for her, she's really strong and and, uh, and brave. Uh, what 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 she what she leave you? No, but the thing is, um, she 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 have she has such. Um, a huge pain loss in her heart and um, and um, and she's gonna be someone uh, vulnerable when she was sh she's gonna leave Paris um, and um, and sometimes you have to make some choice in your life so um, she's gonna have to make a lot of choice not easy and um, and it tells a lot about her to take and, uh, different choices. The, the show is, is split between uh, family drama and, and spy thriller, and this aspect makes the show rich of narrative shades. Uh, but uh, what hit you the most about this story? No, but what, it is, it, it's, it, what is interesting about this TV show, it it's provides such a unique lo look about what happened there, what happened in Syria what happened to these women who fights against domination and oppression and fanatism and they have to take the gun and they just want to, they don't care to survive. They just want to have a free country. And, uh, and when they have the tea and the cigarettes, they sing. And, um, and it's very, very interesting and, and powerful to follow these girls because they are very brave and uh, I have a lot of admiration for them and it's and what's it's uh, really impressive because it's no sorry tell me no sorry please please go no, on no i forgot i forgot okay um what really impressed me about this show is the ability to change uh, languages and uh, perspective uh, really quickly and um this, this uh, gives to the show an international atmosphere. I would like to know how it was for you to work with, um, with the director and this incredible international cast. No, but what it is interesting is you, you, you work with an Israeli director, you work with an Israeli screenwriter, you work with some English actors and Moroccan act actors and Kurdish actors and it's the mixture of all this language all this culture and uh, everybody is together just to to well to make it possible to achieve a rich and a nourished vision 
um, because it's um, it's it's a rich vision about what the what we are trying to tell. Do you see what I mean or not? Attends, c'est pas yeah. du tout. And, and uh, the the show is set in uh, 2013, but uh, before shooting the show, how much did you know about these um, about all film? male militia fighting uh, uh, ISIS in Syria and, and what and what did you discover about them working on this project? No, but in fact, uh, it, in France, it's a um, topical subject and Syria is not very far from our country. Mm -hmm. It's not very far from Italy. You just have to cross, to cross an ocean and you are in, in, in this war. Um, but um, what we know is, I mean, in France, we suffered um, many times of terrorist attack, um, even today. I mean, every week we have a terrorist attack and it's something very insidious and underground because you feel that sometimes it's behind you because you don't have any terrorist attack in France or everywhere. And, um, and then it explodes one more time and it's something completely tragic and um, unacceptable. And you feel that the world trembles. Um, but um, no, but what I like with this TV show, it's, uh, it, 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 um, it's such a part of a, of a current debate, mm -hmm. you know? Yeah. The, um, and I'm very admirative of these uh, women who, who took the gun to fight against, against Daesh. And uh, like A Perfect Day and uh, The Five Bloods, the show uh, tell about war from a very uh, precise perspective. Uh, but for you, which is the main strength of, of the story of the show? The mean what? The main uh, strength. Uh, the, the reason why this show is so unique? Uh, what I feel is you need to have the desire to work with a director and the most of the time it's because you admire his thought, his grammar, his mastery and, um, and how he gives a vision of uh, what is the world we are living into. And, um, and I felt that it was uh, essential to, to be a part of it because, uh, because, uh, non, chérie. Um, because it's, uh, it's, um, c'est terriblement actuel. Totally act, do you, do you understand? Totalement actuel? Yeah. Oui. So thank you so much for your time. Merci.